But we now in this generation now, I think have to adapt and change. Because there's a consequence to not speaking about these things. They stored in the back room somewhere and they come out as, you know, alcoholism or yeah, they other do. addictions and, or and, and anger. We've all seen that in people around us. You know, I've got a couple of friends who've had issues in the last four or five years that I would never have imagined, would never have even thought. And you think, how have I not spotted that? How have I not seen that? How have we not opened up to each other about that? So we have to, we have to encourage it. Hopefully that's what we're doing here. Yeah. I wanted to ask you a, a, a question that I've asked pretty much, I think the last 10 guests as well, which is if you were to view your own personal happiness and fulfillment as a recipe of ingredients, when you look at that list of ingredients, what do you think is missing from that recipe for you to be completely happy? The closing question that's been written for you from, from our previous guest is, what are some words you've not said to somebody? Why haven't you said them? I think it would be to my mum. I never mentioned my mum and without a shadow of a doubt, she's the best person that I've ever met in my life. 